Liv Morgan is currently one of the fastest upcoming superstars in the WWE. Dating back to her main roster debut a few years ago, it was always rumored that Liv was the favorite out of the Riot Squad group and that WWE had a lot of plans for her singles career. And we're starting to see the beginning of that right now. But let's take a look deeper into Liv Morgan's life and find out more about her. Here are 10 more things you didn't know about Liv Morgan. Number 10. Liv Morgan was born on June 8, 1994 as Gianna DiDio. Liv has five other siblings, one sister and four older brothers. So Liv's household was definitely dominated by the boys. Being around so many brothers, Liv learned how to be more tough and grow into that tomboy role, so to speak. And even though Liv never had a big run in the indie scene, Liv was backyard wrestling with her brothers since a really young age. Liv joked that she would always be the one taking the bumps and would often like to pretend that she was Lita. Liv was obviously a huge Lita fan, and that's who she always loved to play as during those backyard wrestling days. Number 9. Dropping Out of High School Believe it or not, Liv never got to finish high school and ended up dropping out when she was just about to enter her junior year. Liv claimed that she left school due to family issues and the fact that no one was really pushing her and checking in on her. Liv started off by missing a few days of class, but those days kept adding up and she eventually just lost control of her schoolwork and attendance. Liv put some of the blame on her household as well. With six kids being in the house, Liv said that there really wasn't anyone checking her homework or even checking to see if she went to school. The school even wanted Liv to repeat her sophomore year, but she had no interest in that at all. Her grades were all high. The main issue was that she was never there at school. So when Liv heard that she had to repeat the year, she ended up dropping out of school and took her GED exam instead. The GED exam is a test that's made for the individuals that don't get to finish high school and examines you on all the levels of high school work with one single exam. Liv didn't study for the exam, but easily passed on her first time taking the exam. After passing her GED, Liv was looking for a job. So let's get into that. Number eight, Hooters. Liv would attend this gym center and right across the street was a Hooters restaurant. Liv had seen a few things about Hooters and thought she'll never want to work there. But it was just so close by to where she was at that she figured it was fast money. Liv would end up getting the job at Hooters, which helped connect her to her WWE future. While working one day, a WWE superstar walked into Liv's restaurant. All of the servers knew about Liv's love for wrestling, so they brought her over to meet and talk to the superstar that was there. Liv explained to them that she wanted to wrestle and asked them for help. But Liv explained that they probably didn't think much of her comments coming from a blonde girl in a Hooters uniform. But Liv was as serious as she could be. She knew from when she was five that she would be in WWE. But this individual that Liv met from the WWE kept in touch with her and later introduced her to Joe DeFranco. Joe DeFranco would end up training and working out with Liv, which led right into her WWE tryout. And according to Joe, Liv absolutely crushed her WWE tryout. Number 7. Her first time on an airplane After training for several months and preparing for her tryout, Liv had to take a flight to get over there. Only problem was that Liv never got on a plane before, so she had no idea what was going on in the airport. She panicked and called her trainer because she saw everyone bringing some of their bags onto the plane. But Liv had checked her bags in and thought that she had lost them for good. She was unaware that you were allowed a carry-on. So that was Liv's funny and first experience with the airport. Number 6. Liv's debut and time with the Riot Squad meant so much to her that she got the date that they debuted tattooed on the back of her neck. Number 5. Liv Morgan was once dating former WWE superstar Enzo Amore. The two got together shortly after Liv had just signed with WWE. Number 4. Liv's Mysterious Car Crash Story Enzo revealed that he would let Liv drive his Dodge Dart when he wasn't in town, and they called it the Gianna Mobile. Liv was just learning how to drive at the time, so she got into a few small accidents with the car, and that's how it got its nickname. But one day, the car went missing and was found completely destroyed and totaled. 
Enzo said that till this day, he still doesn't know the full story of what happened to the car. Number three, Liv and Enzo's breakup. Their breakup went public because Enzo was apparently at a club when he started to flirt with some of the dancers there, telling them that he was single when he was definitely with Liv at the time. The club worker took to Twitter to expose Enzo on what happened, and the couple reportedly broke up shortly after that. Number two, Enzo then made a song for Liv titled Live a 30 for 30. The song was by no means a love song or an apology at all. Enzo spends majority of the song taking shots and dissing Liv. Liv responded to the song by saying, thank you, next, and said she was focused on her upcoming WWE show. Number one, Liv Morgan's sneaker collection. Liv Morgan is up there as one of WWE's biggest sneaker heads. If you're looking at a Liv Morgan picture, then take a look at her sneakers because you'll probably find her wearing something rare or expensive. From the rarest Jordans to Kanye West's Yeezys to Gucci flip-flops, Liv has all of the most popular footwear in the world and will even post her latest pickups onto her Instagram. And that about completes this top 10 list of Liv Morgan. Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and if you learned anything new, about Liv Morgan. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like if you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, guys.